What's up guys and welcome to New Tarot. I am the energy and intuitive reader and I'm here to do the general reading for somebody. So let's see who's going to get this. Aries. What's up Aries? Thank you so much for being here. This message can resonate with you if you have Aries as a sun, moon, rising, or Venus sign. The energy might be reversed for you Aries so take it how it resonates and leave the rest. All right, Aries. Uh, let's see. Happy birthday if it's your birthday. Aries. I feel like there's something you're holding back. Like maybe there's something that you got to say and you're not saying it or something. Okay. Um, I feel like you need to say it. Because this is... um. It's like weighing heavy on you, I feel like. And, and I don't feel like you you notice how um how much is weighing on you cuz I feel that. And it's, it's it's heavy. All right? So say something. Say what you need to say. I don't think that's how the song goes. But <laughs> new beginnings. Wow. It could it could be about a new beginning, whatever it is that you have to say. Okay? So, yeah, speak up. Okay? All right, so let's see, Aries, what's going on? Bottom of the deck is new beginnings. <laughs> the card still came out, Aries. So this is all happening because you're you're going on a new beginning. This new beginning is going to be very beautiful and very abundant, all right? And I feel like you have been very patient waiting for this new beginning, okay? And it's coming. It's crazy. I saw I saw truth also when I was shuffling. All right. So the first card you have is flexibility here. There's something that you have to be a little more flexible with. You can't do you can't move maneuver the same way you, you have in the past. OK, you have to be flexible. Don't try to control this energy. Maybe in the past you try to control it and wanted it to go your way. Um, but this is like compromising. This is like sometimes, you, you know, you're not going to get what you want type of energy. Um, but they're asking you to do this. What is this flexibility here, Spirit for Aries? Okay. Bottom of the deck is the Ace of Pentacles in reverse. You have the Eight of Pentacles in reverse with the Hierophant in reverse. What is going on, Aries? The Fool in reverse and the Nine of Cups in reverse. What is going on? <sighs> There's something here that doesn't match your morals and your values. Okay? This is just, I just, this is just, we, I don't understand this. Why? You're focused on the wrong thing. This is heavy, Aries. What's going on? Um, you're focused on the wrong thing. You're going towards an opportunity or something here with this Ace of Pentacles in reverse. And I feel like it's like once this card came out like this, this is what, this is what I'm seeing. It's like the universe was like, and this is what they need to be doing with the Three of Swords in reverse is healing. Is like focusing on your healing. I feel like you're trying to maybe go towards a new um, prosperous opportunity. Um, but it's like the universe is kind of like, no. <laughs> like... And I feel like it's because it's not really what you want. And they kind of just don't want you to spend your time, your energy doing that. Like That's really what I'm getting. With the Eight of Pentacles in reverse, it's not, it's not hard work, whatever this is. But it, I just feel like it's a, I don't know how to say it, like a time filler. And, but it's like they're just like, you know, it's like they're basically saying like you don't have time right now. 
to be doing all of this extra stuff. It's like they want you to be focusing on healing a disappointment or your heart right now. I want to clarify why, because you're really in your head. So why, why? This is a, this is a crazy message right now. <laughs> why, spirit? Three of Pentacles in reverse, the Justice card, and the Nine of Wands in reverse with the Queen of Swords in reverse. Because it's not going to work out the way you think. So they don't want you to waste your time. This could be like a school, a job. I don't know. Queen of Swords in reverse. It, 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 and it's not, it's like, it's not, it's not going to make you feel um, like yourself. That's what I'm getting. I don't even know if that makes sense to any of y'all. <laughs> That's what I'm getting. Also, I would kind of hold off on starting anything new right now because we are Mercury retrograde. So nothing is going to stick. Okay. Um, so I will be careful with starting anything new. With the Justice card here, I feel like, you know, things are going to be balanced in your life. Um, if you're doing this because maybe, you know, because there's a part of your life that, you know, could could need, could use some more help than the other part. Um, the universe is saying like it will be balanced out once you balance out your heart. Once you balance out this healing that you know you have to do that could be affecting you saying something like I said in the beginning of the video. Um, it's like they want you to work on that because I feel like I feel like this new beginning isn't going to happen the way that you that it's like the way that you're used to do everything happening. It's like this new beginning is something that is going to transform you. It's, you're going through a huge transformation this year, Aries. All, a lot of us are. I'm also an Aries, so I definitely, um, I definitely understand, you know, the need to go and like do something. But the universe is saying not to, not right now. Hold off, okay? Because I just don't see it working the way that you do. And, and again, this time right now, the universe doesn't want you to be going after any um you know opportunity right now they want you to be focusing on your healing ace of cups is here the six of swords that's how you're going to move forward is by pouring into you loving on yourself here doing the things that you want to do okay all right so the next card you have is community all right so this is the people around you there's, I feel like the people around you are seeing the transformation that you're going through, Aries. Because I feel like you're acting different. You're doing different things. Okay. King of Pentacles in reverse. Yeah, watch your spending. What is this community? Bottom of the deck is a judgment. Yeah, the King of Cups, the Magician, the Two of Cups in reverse, and the Seven of Wands. What? Oh, no. This is crazy. Aries, who are these people? Three of Wands in reverse, the Judgment, the Queen of Swords in reverse, and the Eight of Wands. They've been a burden, huh? They've been a burden. Um, okay, so I don't know. So these people here. Okay. Aries. There's people that you're around, okay? Um, I don't even know how to say this. Like, I don't even want to say this because it's just so effed up. There's people that, that are around you that are like rooting for something to not work out for you with the two of cups in reverse, crossing the magician. With the king of cups and the seven of wands here, I feel like you really care about whatever this is and you're willing to fight for it with the seven of wands. But it's like they're making it hard for you to be able to like be in this energy enjoy something else this could be a friendship with the two of cups this could be a um a love relationship whatever but i still see you being successful and moving forward no matter what 
but you're being told this for a reason. You have to create boundaries from these people because I feel like they could cause delays. Um, you're still going to be moving forward, but it's like the, it's like you don't need this energy around you. All right, then you have the Eight of Wands, the Three of Wands in reverse, the Queen of Swords in reverse, and the Judgment. It's just like, it's like I feel like these people are judging you in a way that doesn't make sense because they're judging you, and it's just kind of like, where are you in your life? You know what I'm saying? Like these people, it's it's like they're judging you on things that they shouldn't be judging you on because they're not in a place to be judging. You know, I feel like there's a lot of online chatter with the Eight of Wands. Um, could also be like a lot of messages back and forth between everyone and between this whole community. Okay, it could be a community of people like school or something that you, a club or something like that. Um, could even be family for some of you or, you know, a friendship group. You, you, you would know what this is. I, I, I don't feel like you're oblivious to what, like, I feel like you know what I'm talking about right now. I also feel like you feel like that's it's going to start causing delays for you. I do. I do. So, yeah, we'll see what they got to say about them when we ask for the advice towards the end, okay? But that's just, they want you to be aware. For those that don't know, now you know, okay? You, like, it's like, and you're in this new beginning, so I don't feel, it's like... I don't know i don't get it like why why can't they just you know do what they got to do and leave you alone like i don't get it why does it matter what you're doing why does it matter um i also feel like for some of you this transformation it's like it's like you're you're changing in a way where it's like they don't have access to you in the same way anymore and that could be what is um that could be what is bothering them the most you know, but that's not because of this situation. I feel like it's because you're transforming and you're realizing that certain things just don't add up anymore. You know, like I don't it's like it's like you're coming up with this realization and it's like these people are blaming it on whatever this thing is here that you care about. And you're just like, no, I this is just what it is, you know. Um, but yeah, that's what I'm getting. All right. The next card is truth. Oh, Aries. Uh, let's see what this truth is. So some truth is coming. Some truth is coming. The sun in reverse. Could be about a Leo. Oh, man. I don't think you're going to be happy about it, though, with the sun in reverse. Let's see what this is. What is this truth? Ooh. Eight of swords in reverse. It will get you out of your head, though. So that's something, right? All right, what is this truth? Bottom of the deck is a five of pentacles. You're the world in reverse, the page of wands in reverse. What? The knight of cups and the queen of wands in reverse. Oh my gosh. Oh, Aries, Aries, Aries. What are we going to do with these people who just don't get it? What are we going to do with them? <laughs> we are also Mercury retrograde. People from the past are coming back. They've been they've been in the energy since freaking the beginning of this month, okay? The high priestess could be a, a Pisces here. Listen to your intuition. Your intuition has been telling you this is going to happen and I'm just about to confirm it, okay? Um <sighs> Yeah, you're going to be stressed. All right. So, this truth is coming. There's someone here that wants that wants to wants to speak from the heart, Aries. All right, could be a fire sign, Aries, Leo, Sag, or a water sign, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, who, um, a Taurus, a Leo, and a, or an Aquarius. Whoever this person is, like, <sighs> like I'm just so I'm frustrated because I feel the frustration. It's like it just didn't work. It's, it doesn't work any time that this person comes back around with the world in reverse. They're coming back around, and it's like it doesn't work every time that they do. So I don't understand, but they got some truth to tell you. That's the reason why they're coming. Um, you have the Nine of Swords, the Ace of Swords in reverse, and the Five of Pentacles. I feel like this is what they're they're gonna try to tell you. But let we're gonna um we're gonna clarify. All right. I feel like this person is gonna be lying. Whatever they're saying, I don't feel like it's true. Um, the Six of Swords and the King of Swords in reverse. They just want to mentally move on for themselves. It's it's like. It's like their guilt could be eating them alive and they just they just want 
it's like it's like they if they're just like well if i reach out to aries and if at least i say this you know then i'll be then you know my my slate will be clean it's like this person is trying to like bypass the whole fact that um what they did or something or like what happened between you and this person um the magician this person is manifesting you aries if you if you catch yourself thinking about this person or something like that it's because they're manifesting you what is this nine of cups four cups the king of pentacles in reverse and the five of swords with the nine of swords yeah this person has been bored and lost without you oh this person also has experienced financial loss okay um they're stressed the f out because nothing is working out in their life and they want to come tell you that you make them really happy and they want to work things out with you they're still open to the situation if you are and they have a plan this person has a plan um, but this person is not independent. This person um, wants you to depend on them. Like they, like, like they want you there again, clinging onto, the, onto them. Yeah, this person thinks that it's going to work, but I don't think it's going to work. Because I, like, I feel like you're going to know. You're going to be like, do you not remember what the F you did? All the hurt, all the pain, all the disappointment. You're, I don't trust you. You're not reliable, like at all. You're bugging you're bugging that's what i feel you're gonna do and it's like this this person is gonna experience a, a loss again you know but you know what sometimes you sometimes you need to hear it four or five seven times in order for for it to be for you to get it you know what i'm saying that's what this person i'm assuming that's what this person is um needs okay they need another reminder so just remind them again aries that's all you gotta do all right or you or you could block control alt delete and um there's that <laughs> you know don't even allow the but don't even allow this person to get the, the as far as to being able to reach you make yourself unreachable okay all right what is this flexibility you have message okay so um with the moon ooh, yeah whatever this is aries that the universe is like don't um you know don't invest don't invest in this new opportunity i feel like they just want you to wait because i feel i feel like there's something better with the message that's coming in okay so just hold on wait until after mercury retrograde i would at least something is gonna fit you a lot better okay they want you to heal right now focus on that focus on your healing what is community loving on yourself okay being by yourself um high priestess of water <clears throat> you really care about these people like a lot but you know what they're doing your intuition is telling you what they're doing. You have success, loyalty, and groove at the bottom. Like, these people are not going to move. Look at this cat. They have been sitting there for mad long. This cat has been sitting. They're not going to change, Aries. They're not. And you need to be loyal to yourself with this loyalty and success. That is how you're going to be successful. You can care about these people all you want, but you can't. What are you going to do? Sit on this on this freaking couch with them? No. Because you're not, because you're you're transforming. You're not you're not like that. You know that you have to get up and move. You know you have to. Don't allow people to um, hold you back, Aries. What is this truth here? It doesn't matter how much you care about them. Okay, you have strength card. Could be a Leo. Didn't I say that already? Yeah, I did earlier. Hmm. Two Leos now. Um, I feel like I feel like the universe wants you to stay strong because this person is gonna come in in a way where you can't ignore it with this or with this um look at this love what was that obedience and high high priestess of spirit that's why the universe has been warning you about this because they're gonna come in real hard okay um like i don't know it, it, it's like this person knows that they have to come like on a thousand 
and but they're gonna come on a thousand but you're still gonna say no you know what i'm saying um but the universe wants you to remember you know to treat this energy with love like you know don't get crazy you know <laughs> like i know how aries gonna get don't get like that treat this energy with love and care like if it was your child i know you guys don't have a child or if it was your little brother or your little sister okay walk on this rope of like you know niceness you know tender love um because i feel like you're being you know you're being tested i feel like the universe kind of wants to see what have you learned aries let me see let's see all right so you'll be able to show them all right all right aries all that i have for you i hope this helped have a good day or a good night whenever you watch this and stay positive